everybody. So I wanted to show you about the mental blank. Um, the one book is Success is Not an Accident, which is part of the mental bank concept. I've posted a Facebook video link to the website for hypnosis.edu um, where I learned about hypnotherapy through the college. Um, this is the mental bank ledger book. And so I wanted to tell everybody that... Okay, so I've done a lot of different self-help programs over the years for various reasons. Um, I have done a lot of them, more than I care to admit. Um, these two, well, this is the book to tell you how to do it besides online video, and then this is where you actually write your numbers down. Um, I'm not authorized to teach um, the mental bank program. That's the college that you can go through for that. Um, what I want to say is that I thought this was nothing but a joke. <laughs> I'll just be plain honest and simple. I really seriously thought it was a joke because I'm like, seriously, I've done Dave Ramsey. I've done that whole ordeal. I've done that. I've done boundaries classes. I've done whole slew of Bible studies. I've done this. I've done that. I've done Law of Attraction. I've done those type of programs. I've done it all. But this one, however, has made the most sense for me and so many other people. And basically the concept of this mental bank is that you pay yourself and you do affirmations, but it's all small goals. And so small goals are small, measurable, attainable, and something else I don't remember. That's okay, because that's just the way life is. So anyways, my mental bank goal, you take your reality income. Um, so you take your reality yearly income, which mine I was surprised with health and everything I figured should be roughly about 36000 That's with the medical assistance I get. That's... My planning of different things like that is what I'm trying to say. And then food stamps and whatnot. So I'm just saying that's an example of everything that I used. Um, then you times that by two because you double it. Well, then I got 72000 is what my new mental bank is. So then I put all that in my book of my different goals. And so one of my goals... On here is to do my mental bank um, another one is to follow up with people put my clothes away because I do not like folding or putting clothes away just ask my husband he ends up doing it most of the time because I don't like doing clothes I'll clean the toilets I'll do dishes I will not do the clothes I do not like putting clothes away I don't like folding them that's not one of my things I like to do but it's in here so anyway I've got that listed. You know, I've got my Facebook Lives to do. I've got, you know, play with my boys so that way it's not just I'm on a phone or doing things. So I remember, not remember, but so I do different things. They're going to make me better overall. So I've got that listed. I've got read my Bible, those different things. So what I do is I pay myself $72 an hour or a flat rate. So... Anyway, on um, this side, I'm writing all the stuff that I do, paying myself for all the stuff that I do, the hours or the rate, the hours of it, um, or if it's flat or whatever. And I put the dollar amount in there, and then I put um, the dollar amount at the end, how much I've earned and accumulated. And then over here, on my mental bank happenings, I put all the positives for the day. I tell you, that's harder than it looks sometimes because there's days I'm like, what was a good thing that happened? Because I cannot think of anything good that happened. And then I remember my husband still loves me. So that's a good thing. Um, my boys still love me. And that's a good thing. 
so I make sure to write down that my husband and my sons love me. <coughs> so if nothing else is for a good day for me, at least I know my husband and my sons still love me. And I know my animals still love me too. I, I kind of wonder about a couple of them if they still do. But anyhow, I mainly put down the main important ones. And then I put my affirmation in here, which is like how many clients I'm going to be hypnotizing a week. And my goal is to make more money to be able to deal with um, stuff in life or getting my son back. So, because um, I know <laughs> GoFundMe and all that is just a joke when I've tried to do stuff like that before. Um, so I know that that's not going to get my son back. So it's up to me to be the best I can be. And so that is a short of the mental bank of how it works is that basically it works on the negative part of our brains, which I have no idea how it works, but it works. <laughs> Every day I think of different positive things that have happened, even though my life has been through a lot. I can think of different positives throughout life. And I tell you, that alone has helped me as a person since I started doing this. I've only been doing this um, mental bank for about two weeks. I don't remember when I started even. I started on 12, no, not 12, 19. That's not when the contract was. December 3rd. <coughs> is when I started this and December 3rd till now it's December 28th um, in just 25 days I've noticed a huge difference um, in my personality how I'm looking at different things how I look at things now versus how I used to look at things I am doing more as far as moving myself along on things I no longer look at it as it's the first of the month and then the third of the month my SSI is gone, my disability is gone, and then I got no money for the rest of the month and what the hell can I do? I no longer think that way. I'm thinking now, where are my hypnosis clients? Who can I help today? You know, through my hypnosis or who can I help through my young living? You know, who can I help? So that's what I've been focusing on more instead of, okay. What can I do for the rest of the month? Because I have no money for the rest of the month. So instead of focusing on what I don't have, I've been focusing more on what can I do to help others while still helping myself. So that is one thing that I do like about that mental bank. And it's given me a lot <laughs> in these short 25 days, now that I've thought about it. It's actually given me quite a bit more than I thought it would and I've missed a couple days out of it and the days that I've missed I haven't done it those are the days that have been my worst yeah. good no, yeah good to know that I think about that now but yeah the days I haven't done it it's been my worst days so as long as I keep doing it things seem like they're doing okay so Anyway, I'm eventually going to get up to my goals so that way I can get to where I want to go. So I do want to thank you. And again, um, I can't teach you guys this, but I can tell you where to get the material, which is through hypnosis.edu. And again, it's hypnosis.edu. They are like the best place to get any hypnotherapy type training um, the success is not an accident mental bank like I said um, it is truly the best place to go for education as far as I'm concerned with the different places that I've had education and I know it's backwards but um, it's success is not an accident the mental bank concept which I've posted that on um, my timeline before so I just wanted to do a quick little thing of this because this mental bank concept in 25 days has changed me and I like it and this is one of those things that I'm not gonna stop anytime soon because I like it so I want to thank you for watching this and if you have any questions on the video or you just want to chat 
you know where to find me.